So the last thing that we need to see today or in the next weeks are unelected bureaucrats pushing through regulations at the 11th hour. We look forward to tackling regulatory reform in the new unified Republican government. In the new unified Republican government. In the new unified Republican government. Um, that might very well be the... In the new unified Republican government. In the new unified Republican government. Um, that might very well be the scariest phrase I've ever heard in my entire life. Are you kidding me right now? This is what they stole the election for. This is the end, folks. This is the end of America. This is the end of democracy as we know it. You should have written in Frank Parrish, you idiots. Dude, I told you not to call the American people idiots. Dude, the American people are stupid, man. You can't blame the people. They don't... Billions of dollars have been used to thread this narrative through the media. Okay, they've been snookered. The American people have been snookered. Yeah, I know it's the media's fault, dude. Well, you know, man. <clears throat> you know, buddy, maybe they'll write you in in 2020. And then you'll be president, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Maybe they will. <laughs> That'd be cool. Cause you gotta ride in Frank Barish, yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, Frank Barish will save America, oh yeah. Heck yeah, I'll save this country. That's what I'm here for. Frank Barris will save America. Oh, yeah. Seriously, though, folks. Seriously, though, folks. We're in trouble. This is going to be a disaster for democracy. We're going to have to actively resist. You, every single one of you, everyone in America, needs to get involved in politics. If that means running for a local school board or running for a congressional seat. That could mean calling your congressman. Yeah, look it up. Look up who your congressperson is. And you need to start getting active and making sure that they're doing the right thing and standing up to some of the ridiculousness that's just coming. You know it's coming. We all know it's coming. That's why, that's why they stole the election. And that's why they have a unified Republican government on the horizon. A unified Republican government. They're just calling the Republican government now. It's just... <sighs> wow. Hang tough, America. Four more years and we can do the real thing. We can all get together and we can write in Frank Barish. And I'll save this country. But until then, well, I don't have any power. Because... <sighs> it was down to Trump and Hillary and... Well, we all know how that turned out. And the rest, as they say, is history. Seriously, though, call your congressperson. Make sure that they're going to stand firm against the takeover of American democracy, the destruction of American democracy by a unified Republican government. They stole the election, folks. This is an assault on democracy. We take it back nonviolently. There's no overthrow. How are you going to overthrow these people? We're going to make sure on the local level that we're taking action and we're getting involved in politics and we're making sure that the local politicians, the Congress people, the senators, they're going to stand firm. They're going to do the right thing and they're not going to just fold under the pressure of this insanity. Just hang on for four years, America, and then I'll save you. I promise. I'm Frank Barish, and I'm going to have to wait four years, but I still want to be your president, America. Let's do this. I love America. America, America. We can do this, America. We can do this. We'll get through this. We'll get through this together, I promise. Frank Barris will save America. Oh, yeah.